literally, I, I promise you, I am guilty of not really doing anything but scrolling on my phone for hours. I personally believe that doing that, and I do this ever so often, every couple of months I'll do this, but I believe it's important to give yourself that decompression, give yourself that time away from the screen, and see what it can do. Get outside, that's an example you could do in the nice weather. Get outside and enjoy some fresh air off of your screen. Hello, hello friends, please ignore my hair, it's just all over the place today. Um, but, hello, welcome back. Today's video is going to be a social media update. I've done this video, but it was many, many years ago, back when I first started this channel. So to start off, I have three types of social media, and that is Instagram, Snapchat, and Facebook. I'll leave a list on the screen somewhere. I use all three of those pretty frequently, however, I do not post on them. I use them to check messages with friends or family, but I don't post on them all the time like I used to. I personally believe that it is incredibly important to know when to take a step back from the internet. Because if you guys did not know, everybody is on their phones or some type of electronic device from the moment you wake up to the moment you go to bed. I definitely do recommend that any of you that are watching this video right now, hopefully this will, this video will be up soon, um, I definitely recommend you take a social media detox for at least just one day, not posting. You can still check your messages and everything, do what I do, but don't post and see how good it feels. Literally, I, I promise you, I am guilty of not really doing anything but scrolling on my phone for hours and staring at a screen. I mean, I stare at my computer for several hours a day, like I mentioned. But after a while, staring at a screen like that, that is considered unhealthy to, like, I'll give you an example. Here's an example. Back when I first was uh, in high school, I had an active face. I had a very active Facebook, and mean, what I mean by that is I would be actively on it from the time I got up until I got home from school, and then I would be on it for hours, messaging people, posting cra crazy photos. I would be on it for hours, and I got to, I got to realizing, why isn't this sitting up? I got to realizing how unhealthy that was. I'm realizing, I was realizing that, you know, being on social media when you get home from school after your homework and chores are done, that was considered a privilege. Of course, that was when I was young. And now I post ever so often on all of the social media, Facebook, Snapchat, and Instagram. I'll actually, I've actually started when I want to start taking a detox, to be honest, or even just in general. I'll go through my Instagram photos. I feel that's also important to take down any old photos that you have already that have already been up there for at least a year or more. I feel like it's important to declutter your page. That way you can make room for both new content as well as it's just healthy to get rid of that stuff, I believe. I'll go through my Instagram photos, the ones that are already posted onto my page profile, and I will pretty much go through and the photos that are extremely old from when I started using Instagram to the ones now, I'll go through and put them in my archive. I definitely do recommend that any of you that are watching this video right now, hopefully this will, this video will be up soon, um, I definitely recommend you take a social media detox for at least just one day, not posting. You can still check your messages and everything, do what I do, but don't post and see how good it feels. I personally believe that doing that, and I do this ever so often, every couple of months I'll do this, but I believe it's important to give yourself that decompression, give yourself that time away from the screen, and see what it can do. Get outside, that's an example you could do in the nice weather. Get outside and enjoy some fresh air off of your screen. Like I said, I do this every couple of months, and it is, I don't want to say life-changing, but it's definitely a game-changer mentally. 
physically and emotionally as well. It's very, very good. I guess the point that I'm trying to make with this video is definitely know when it's time to take a break from your electronics because it can um, relax your mind it can relax your body as a whole. Definitely, definitely do that. It's definitely a game changer and I couldn't recommend it enough.